Luya, ko tulos podcasting network ni Yuno Barangay. Yongo ng lele, si Siu Kalaisi, Hawaii Wafa. Fangai <laughs> Kena umat way mui, ya si suklai si, go lau go tapaki ayah honi filongak betan tak kau, ini hendi ke kau ngah kau ihono, ihono malangak ye for fulla, bermui gospel yo si suklai si, ke lama ke inasia ye ke kau ye for nuah, kau ke ngata pe tongan ke pe for kimulina, nak tolong nak mian biayi, kau ke ngata aku fikir lah happy tog hendi ya, mui five kau go go five kau Susan. Television. Uh, first time here in Tonga, we want to welcome you here, Pastor Susan. And uh, it is a, a privilege to have you and to welcome you here at our station. Um, and I believe that God has already put something in your heart to share with us today. And it's going to be a blessing to all our people and our viewers today. And also, I want to thank you, Cecilia Fiao. Who is part of our team today? Uh, uh, she'll be translating for Pastor Susan, and uh, it's going to be a blessing for all of you. And someone is going to sing for us today, and uh, she'll be singing later on. But I want to welcome uh, all of them in this program. And Tatali Fifiak Motol Tope Momia Mai Pokama Goni, Mavambe Gihok Mai Pokama Goni Kotapo Keri Motol Momia Mai. Pengambil ulang lagi ahi, fermafan ahi, filong aki mengekai, orang nak tupa, orang nak mui, ke malangak i, aku spelio si sklasi, ko mui anga peya, ke dekau tolu, kau ngah kau frata ahi toh pelau, ke hono ave aku speli, ke tapa ke tapa peo mama ni ke ngah tapi tongan ke pefoki, ke ngah fonua orang tau iya takka. Pengaya fengam malay ko ni, ko fampe ke uraki fape ke tadano mo efekau presteni. Mencon mak, dia kau tuang ke PGT, efeknya mari kau ini, ke fafiloaki Maya, be pefoki ke ngau, nau fahoko, be mei Amerika, be kau gengatai, way fok mau ngau itu ngani, way kau ngalotu nau lelek nau tol, fahoko ya perhaki, be kau tui, kau kau tapak kia kita ngai ah kau ni, kau efekau, kau faham kau tuat kau dengan kau, efeknya mari kau ni, malu apa itu? Kau nih, faham malu ada. Nah, kita faham tak betul apa itu faham kita begini. Ah, faham tak betul ini faham faham siang hari itu dua kau. Ah, tetapi kalau melihat film lagi berbuat terhina kau ini, nah kita ulah itu faham lebih baik itu. Ah, faham siang hari itu nah kita faham faham aku, nah kita buat lagi aku. Aku kau faham formai ye atau dua ye mui. Kalau berbeza bulan ini, faham lebih mesti kita nak tanggung mengalir fakta dalam pasien gue iman dulu lah ke Nico Williams. Biar faham mai mengalir biar mai ye wah fakta fitu. Biar faham kau mai ye pasien ni wang ye atau dua ye ke ke step down ni biar mai ye. Pakar apa pun kita hanya ilok ya, uhinga, uhinga kau itu, ah, untuk fakar hukum mai, pera kau ni mian panggil ya, kau harus berani untuk fakar hukum mai kau ya, step down di pemeh ministry, pera tak tahu apa itu, kian dia, 
ko hi ko talanga ina ko ha u pe mui mui holo ya ko e ko support e nga o fai e o to ya ko e kana e ya e u ya ai o to ana e fa fo ma ya e ta ta hiva fitu hiva ya centuri ko loi o hi nga ai e kuno fo america na si o me centuri ha u ko ya fo ma i san mateo fo ma me vancouver ke u fo ma yo stop over pepa u fo ki mai na u ma na ko bi dai no fo nu si la kai ho po ai i san mateo o tala mai e centuri ko loi tala mai o tua ke ke no fo e american pa ko ko fo i tari pe ko ke ke palo fitago da ke centuri ko ke ha ku visa ku ke no fo ai american Aye go 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 faka poto ipe ya eta eta ri go ke te no fo america pe ta mai centuri e me choni ko lao a mama ni no fo he ko lao ai o tu a ku he o controlo hi fo lao a mama ni ko ha pe fi na lao o tu a pe ne ngu ko ke ha o visa ka ha pe o tu a o atu ko o pepa mo citizen i america pe ka te o ki mu ape he nga we na ku hanga pe ya uya o ilo ma alang kita taka moto nga centuri pe kai ke ulawa ya faka ikai ya me na usi wa ho mata i he man ai o tua pe pe ta ri pe pe no fo ta ta hai fit balu o wa ma ni ki he a ho no ku ke no fo america pe na ikai ke fi no fo america ka ko e faka ho ko ma he centuri ko si nangalo ai o tua ke no fo ya meli pe ko ne tala mai o ku ya ye me o si nangalo e tua ke teu teu i ko i america ke a vi tonga pe a mai ko ke tau tai mai va tolu pe a pe he e au ko ko e ui ko ya a mi ui ko na fai ko e o tua ka vi ka ya an fo ko 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 centuri na ne ta kai pe ya america i tongani o kore ke ke malanga ipe ka gai e ma inga ko e ke na tari ko si su e pe si o si ko e u yo sen turi pe ho ko ma vika ha vika e mo fo i se ka ko e fo ka fo nu ki mo to ra ga la u ma ri e pe o si ko pa no fo ai pe a ho ni pa ngai ko la ve pe u ma va he le va me he sa si ma no e la le fa e ko to ri fo ka fi si pe ke a vika ba mo na we pe hanga he tau ta hi va fitu va tau ta hi va ta wa fe ta va lu ai ko lo ak sa pat de ko sa no ri wa ta va lu ko sa pat fo o si he sa si ma no la pe au ma va he le ma asi hanga he o tu ata ta ki au ge ki si asi ko ni e ka u muri ko ni pe wa ta ge ai na u sa spente ko si ki na u to e fa se ka o ha o pe avio tamai na do ke ke ha o palestine e manuela ka ku fai se ka pende ko si au i amel ya ya la hinga ita buak eh ka ko ya ngai ko e u ya o tua pe au ko nga la e ku foki mai ko e ke sias i manuela ko fa atala no anga na do ke fu tau a ko pisa ke ne tu fa he he ko ko alat ko e ke pende ko si ko e sen na mo sa a ko ya o fanonga ke na nga hi a ko a mahu inga ko e a fanau i fo pe ai e ki ta fo ka ko si o mai ki mui e o ko e nga hi me ai e ko ko e si a si ai e ko fu ta o ko pi sa na wa nga o ko o ke ri pe ka me o ma o i lo u ha la fa ka va e ko e fu ta o a pe ko si o mai ko e ke mo ui ko e ai nga sias i manuela ko yo lobe pe nga sias ke he ka ko sio mai ko sias i manuela o ko faka tafa tafa ai na u mo ui he pe ha ga le ma e ki o fe ka wa o ke wa o ke to e keri e faka wa e e ma hu inga ko e ke fana i fo o e mo ui pe faka fo no ke la u ma ri e ka e alu nga to pe a na u fo mai i fe bueri i nu sila pe ko e pe ki ai as leri pa u ha u ki tongani ma u lele mai ken mo ka u ngo fai fe ka u ken pe ma u mo se si mo me a mo ka fai fe ka u me nu sila ke fa ka ton ton u pe 
But anyway, I don't want to take too much time now, but uh, I want to pass it on to you, Pastor Susan. Um, can, can you please tell us a little bit about yourself? And then uh, I'll give the opportunity to, for you to minister to our people. Thank you so much. Thank you. <clears throat> well, <clears throat> my name is Susana, and I come from Santa Rosa in California. Uh, <clears throat> Santa Rosa, in California. It's the Pentecostal Church of Santa Rosa. Yes, yes, Pentecostal Santa Rosa. And um, 
my background is I used to be Catholic all my life. I'm, I'm Hispanic, I'm Mexican. So in my culture is a Catholic um, religion. Spain is Mexico, right? Yeah. So when I came to Jesus, um, I realized that I was so sick. So when I got to the church for the very first time, I knew deep in my heart that I should get baptized in the name of Jesus. And getting baptized in the name of Jesus is so crucial in deliverance. And then right after, three times after I got to the church, I got fulfilled with the Holy Spirit the speaking in tongues. And then I got baptized in the name of Jesus. When I come out of water, I felt like something heavy come off of me. I used to do a lot of witchcraft, a lot of New Age stuff. They opened doors so to so many demons. And they almost take me out. That's why I'm so passionate about deliverance because I see how my life was so changed so radically. I was in the church for three years already, and my life was in bondage. for three years. And I was still doing witchcraft, annoying, and, um, and I was a leader already. Until a pastor of mine, she came to my house and told me. And then I had So I threw out all the stuff they had in my home. And it's when God started moving and he brought me to this uh, Pentecostal church of San Francisco. So the second time I was in the church, Pastor Sonny prayed for me. And I got delivered for the first time. And I received a lot of deliverance through ministers and through Holy Spirit himself. So I'm going to share what God placed in my heart. Like I said before, getting baptized in the name of Jesus is so important to be qualified to get delivered. Because repentance is the first thing that we do when we get delivered. And then when we get baptized in the name of Jesus, our sins are 
wipe off our, our spiritual bodies, but our mental, emotional, and our will, it has to be cleansed as well. We going at a pefoki ke fai hotau paptai so for a mat hai tau tuunga for a kakano ke pefoki ke tau tuunga for a lau marie foki. So and then the third thing is get ba baptized by the Holy Spirit, power and holy fire. Going at a pei ka ufema ufoki baptize ufoki motolo a ke lau marie ma oni oni bamhono malohi. So when we get uh, deliver, we are qualified to pray for others to get delivered. Because faith increases when you see the Bible coming alive. Come again, Susan. Come again. Um, I said the faith. Mm increase when I see the Bible coming alive. Okay. And I'm going to read um, scripture. Example about sin, what it does to the physical body. Oh. It's uh, Matthew chapter 9, verse 2. Uh, Matthew verse 2. Says then, then behold, they brought to him a para paralytic lying on the bed. When Jesus saw their faith, he said to the paralytic son, Be good and cheer, for your sins are forgiven. <laughs> One of the main ministers of Jesus was deliverance and healing. They come together. And um, in the book of Matthew, chapter 9, and verse 5 and 6, Matthew, Jesus is speaking. It says, For what, which is easier to say, your sins are forgiven you, or to you say, arise and walk, but that you may know the, the Son of Man has power on the earth to forgive sins. Then he said to Paralic, Arise, take up your bed, and go to your house. So we see how Jesus was forgiving sins and people were getting healed. So we are going to go to the, we are going to stay in Matthew, but we are going to go to chapter 8, verse 28 and 29. Uh, chapter 8, verse, verse 28 and 29. Wabalu bamwe wahiva. 
So it says, when he had come to the other side, to the country, the Yerkneses um, there met him two demon-possessed men coming out of the tombs, exceedingly fierce, so that no one could pass that way. And suddenly they cry out, saying, What? have we to do with you, Jesus, you son of God? Have you come here to torment us before the time? Rehenea o ke kau vai ke whanua o e haa ka tala. Nai whakawhita ulaki mai ke te ia haungotangata. Nai aawea. Ko ena fe hufi me he a aki whanua loto. Ko yongo me a ngao hi ngā taa au pito. Ko ia nai kai uhia ai hala ko ia. Pe ilo a ngena na kalanga o pe he ko ho haa ki mau tolo e alo oi otua ko ke hao ke whakamamahi ilewa ki mau tolo ka oku kei tuai hono taimi. So the presence of God torment demons. I he loto loto nga koi oi otua. Pe koi loto loto nga oi otua O kuhanga he lotolotonga e otua o... What is the word? O whakamamahi i, ai laumari e uri. So, we're going to go to the book of John, chapter 15, verse 7. Te tau alu e tohi ansione, vahe tahanima. Te kono vesi... 7. Verse 7. And it says, if you abide in me and my words abide in you, you will ask what you desire and it shall, it shall be done for you. So the presence of God torment so it's so important to be in the presence of God because where is God is freedom. The key for get deliverance and pray for deliverance is seek God with everything in you. So in John uh, 14, verse 13 and 14. Mm -hmm. It says, John 14, 13 and 14. So it says, and whatever you ask in my name, the, I will do the, the Father name, and I will do the, the Father may be glorified in the Son. If you ask anything in my name, I will do it. Is it John chapter? It's John chapter 14, mm -hmm. verse 13. And 14. So, and the other thing so important for deliverance is have faith in Jesus. Mark chapter um, 2, verse 5. It says, When Jesus saw their faith, he said to the paralytic, Son, son your sins are forgiven you. 
kai e sisu e nau tui pepe e e ia ke mama tea na aka ko fomole mole ho ngai ang hala so faith is so important ko tui o ko me aya ko mahau ina fa to be delivered from demons and pray for deliverance la vai ke fa mo ia ko e me hau longi a lau mari e ori o mo ori if we are going to pray for somebody and we don't believe they got disabled, nothing is going to happen. And if the person doesn't have the teaching and they don't believe, nothing is going to happen either. That's why it's so important the teaching about deliverance. So in Mark 16, verse uh, 16, through 18. I'm going to read from verse 15. And he said to them, Go into the world and preach the gospel to every creature. He who believes and is baptized will be safe. But he who doesn't believe will be condemned. Mm -hmm. And these signs will follow those who believe in my name, in Jesus' name. They will cast out demons. They will speak in new tongues. I'm going to read 18 too. Mm -hmm. They will take up serpents. And if they drink anything poison, it will not uh, means hurt them. They will lay hands on the sick and they will recover. Pag ilo ang e tena wino hami ako koko na e kaya ako pito tena ako na ay tena hindi pa kini magi mahaki pero tena mo oy amen amen so is key the gospel that God wants us to preach at this time of revival is the gospel with power of the Holy Spirit and casting out demons and healing the sick ako tuyo ifo kaya gihmi ako ani Deliverance, but ministry going in In the book of First uh, Corinthians, chapter two, verse four and five, and I'm wrapping. This is Paul speaking. It says, In my speech and my preaching, we're not with persuasive words of human wisdom, but in demonstration of the Spirit and of power. And your faith should not be in the wisdom of men, but in the power of God. Amen. That's powerful. Pero ako ako na ki ka umaa e ko malanga na ika ifay aki ang ahilea fa ka ole ole o e poto kana ifay aki fa mo oni e laumari e o e mafi mafi boy mafi mafi ka yuhi ke o wana atu homo lo tu ihe poto o e tangata ka ihe mafi mafi. Amen. Amen. So the, the gospel that God wants us 
to bring to this time. Ko ko si peri o fi mau he otua ke tau hanga malanga i ko nga ko eni. Is the gospel of the power of God Himself. Ko ko si peri o e malohi o e ki ko si sukalai si. Saying wonders. Ke tau lava ke tau si o ki nga hi mana mo sa mo ui. And people are going to believe because the demonstration. But do we forget that? He got no hang. He got yai and malo yai otua. It ain't mukele a kame. And it's the children's breath. When you get baptized, you become sons and daughters of the Most High God. It ain't mukele. Well, baptized again. It goes in circle. It's okay. How could ever go far now? I otua. Is your true identity? Go identity. You are able to get delivered from generational curses, generational chains, for infirmities, from poverty, from so many demons that are over humanity in this time. La leva ke famo oi ai koe ngai tuku fuka holo ngai maki tuku fuka holo ko to pe ho family. La va leva ke hanga o tua fuka mo oi ai a koe ba mo family. Speaking about that because I'm a living testimony of those things. God delivered me from poverty, for sickness, from all so many generational chains and generational curses that were over my life and and my kids. Inga foki e kulea pehea tu e kainga toi he koe mei na ku foi na hanga he eki kosi sukala si o fa mo oia e ku mo oi me ngai mea katoa peo kulea e kati kati mo tali e pom pom kai. And I've been two years in full-time ministry, and God took me to the nations already. I went to Mexico so many times to preach the gospel. I went to New Zealand, to Australia, and now to Tonga. And he paid full all my trips and my bills and everything. He take care of it. Uya o he otua ki he ngaui fa kamis nale ko eni tau e neu ame yai o ko alo ki he feitu ola he i mama ne ko eni. O ku fai ko tohe o tua hano to tonge ku tiki te tau hi ai he eki kosi sukala isi. So it's so important to receive the gospel; it will change your life. O ku fai mau fagi ke tari ai ongo ngole le ya eki kosi sukala isi he koi ya te ne fai holy liro. So I'm pretty much done. If you guys want to add anything. Thank you so much. Uh, we'll pass it on to do the singer, do a song, and then after that we'll come back. Go to Ben Gikau Hiva, Gigi Nohan Gifa Gifu Hiva, Hiri Goya Hoko de Tapo Kama. And uh, I will ask uh, Pastor Suzanne to pray for those who need deliverance after this song. Eh? You can minister to them uh, watching from the program. I don't know if you have a lot of people who are in the world. I have a television, I have a phone, I have a internet, I have a phone, 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 I have a phone.
Mwana bido hivyo kwa talamai tene toe fai pe e Mea kwa nana e fai hekuo hili tene toe fai pe e Ahoni Fawafita ge ge go hinga kwa ni ofa mwana tawi Fawamalo an ge hiva kwa ome di kita utolgo e falot lahi This time Pastor Susan I want to pass it on to you To start praying for those who are watching the program Maybe they will need prayer You can minister now to them Thank you so much Like I said uh, forgive us God for forgiveness and and renounce whatever sin is because repentance is asking God for forgiveness and receive forgiveness 
but renounce it is detached from the sin. Because so many people think the sin is their, is their personality, but it's a demon. Do you want me to say it again? Oh, yes, please. OK. Uh, what I'm saying is that it's so important to repent to ask God for forgiveness, and we will receive forgiveness from God. And renouncing is be detached from the sin. So, so many people think the sin is their personality. Like, for example, someone who's prideful or who lies or who steal or who is um, mean. Mm -hmm. All of them are demons. Because we've been created in God's image. And it comes with the fruit of the Spirit. There is the opposite of sin. So, to repent, renounce it, and I'm going to pray for God to move and set them free and heal, heal them. Well, generational curses and generational chains to be broken. And when someone is getting delivered, they are going to cough. They are going to, they are going to puke. They are going to scream. And I want them to be focusing God because Jesus himself are going to set them free. So I'm going to pray. Heavenly Father, I come before you in the name of Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. And I ask you, Lord, mm. to come into this place, yes, to so. come into their homes. <coughs> Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus, name of Jesus. I invite you into their homes, mm. into their mm. hearts, Hallelujah. in the name of Jesus. Yes, and I pray, Lord, that you will reveal to them what is the sin yes, that is Lord. blocking the blessing, yes, that is Lord. blocking yes, the Lord. healing, Lord, yes, that is Lord. blocking their finances, yes, Lord. Yes, I pray, Father God, that you will heal this land, yes, Lord, in, in the, the name of Jesus, of Jesus Lord. Yes. I pray that your people will rise Rise up yes, in your Lord. power and claim and proclaim Hallelujah. your presence in this land, Lord. Yes, Lord. Because you've been in the land. Yes. It's yes, prosperity, Jesus. it's yes. healing, it's freedom Hallelujah. in the name of Jesus. I pray, Father God, for those people who's going to watch this program. Yes. I pray, Father God, mm. they will receive yes, what they're yeah. wanting in their hearts, Lord. Yes, yes, I yes. pray, Father God, that this program is mm. going to be a divine appointment to Hallelujah. them, Lord. Yes, there is the answer yes. to their questions. Yes. There Hallelujah. is going to be their hope, Lord, yes, in Lord. you. Yes. They're going to see 
the light shining is you, Jesus, the light of this world, Lord. And I pray that you will shine in this land, Lord, in the name of Jesus, Lord. The every darkness is going to be cast out in the name of Jesus right now by the sound of your voice, Lord, in the name of Jesus, Lord. And I pray, Father God, for their hearts, Lord, to be soft, Lord. I pray, Father God, for any unforgiveness, Lord, to be removed in the name of Jesus, Lord. Any, anything that is blocking, Lord, their blessing, Lord, I pray that it will be removed. Any, any unfaithfulness, Lord, any any lack of faith Hallelujah. is going to be removed by the blood. The trumpet is Hallelujah. right now. It's not time to be in sin. It's Hallelujah. time to wake up yes. Amen. and walk in righteousness yes. because Hallelujah. you've been called righteous yes. if you've been baptized in the name of Jesus. And for those who are not baptized in the name of Jesus yet, I pray that you will receive yes. the wisdom Yes. And the word that you've been seeking after, yes. that your spiritual eyes and your spiritual ears yes. are going to be wide open. Yes, Lord. And you are going to receive what Jesus Christ himself Amen. has for you. Hallelujah. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. 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 Tolgo mo mea, magkabaw na ngay tui. 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 Magkabaw na ngay tui.